con el
Good evening. Hello, hello guys. Good evening. How are you doing? Happy Friday, TGIF. Um, hi, Gabby. Good evening. Great to have you. Belen, hello. Helen. Hello, teacher. Mauricio. Hi, guys. How are you? Is everything okay? Good evening. Good evening, good evening teacher. teacher. Everything is good because it's Friday and doesn't matter what happens. No, I yes, miss. Yeah. <laughs> it matters. <Right. laughs> no. Okay. No, but uh, I'm glad to hear that everything is going fine. So, how was your Friday? Did you have a good Friday? Was it okay? Was it good? No, because I have to work tomorrow. But... Oh, you have to work tomorrow. Uh, I'm sorry it's to hear bullshit. that. Okay, well, I'm sorry to hear about it, but I hope everything goes well, you know. And Saturday normally is a little bit shorter for most of us. So, yeah, I totally get that. But but anyways, thanks so much, guys, uh, for joining today. Hi, Imelda, good evening. Um, Thank you for, for joining, for sharing part of your time with us today. We are um, having session number eight, so we're gonna try to um, move ahead with part of the topics we have. Uh, from yesterday, we still have two topics that are pending. So we were talking about, a, we were having this little debate about cars, motorcycles, and also, also about uh, technology. So I remember you were talking about um, different brands like cell phone brands. So we're gonna okay. work a little bit with that. Uh, but in the meantime, we are going to work a little bit. Uh, hi, Andrea, good evening. So in the meantime, we are going to uh, go over some things that I want to double check with you that are related to simple uh, past tenses. Um, we are going to study today a little bit of a tense agreement as well. And then we're going to like have some speaking practice. Um, so guys, to get us started, I have one little activity for you. And give me one second. And this is the one. So this is like a just no game. Uh, I don't know if you have done this before My or you have is. played this before. Yeah. So the idea is, uh, I'm sorry about the apostrophe. So you cannot say yes and you cannot say no. So um, there are a couple of rules with this game, but pretty much we are going to ask you some questions. Okay. And one, you cannot repeat the answer. For example, if you said maybe, you cannot repeat maybe, okay? And uh, rule number two, you have three seconds to answer. Um, you cannot be thinking like, uh, <laughs> so you cannot be wandering around, okay? So you have to think fast, give an answer fast. And of course, you cannot say yes or no. Uh, I mean, or the synonyms, right? So yeah. Uh, nope. I mean, you cannot use any uh, short answer, so you have to, you know, give us a little bit more. Um, in Spanish, teacher is like ni si ni no ni blanco ni negro. Yeah, but omitimos el blanco y el negro. <laughs> so we're going to omit the colors. We are just going to stay with just no and those uh, two additional rules. You have three seconds to answer, and the other one is that um, you have. Um, what well, you cannot repeat the same answer, right? So you have to use any other expression, any other way to answer this, but you cannot repeat. Um, so we're going to have a couple of big teams to get us started. Let's see how it goes. Let's see if we are able to, uh, you know, come up with some answers, right? Without saying the yes and no thingy. So uh, again, this is like super, super quick. Let's, let's have a try, okay, let's have a try. So, okay, so let me see. Gabby, I'm going to take you there. <laughs> so I see Gabby ready. So Gabby, let me get started with you. So again, you cannot say okay. yes, you cannot get say me. no. Hi, um, you cannot repeat the same answer, okay? Or you get a penalty, so you get you get like a punishment. 
Okay. And uh, you have three seconds only to answer. Are you Trans ready? Uh, no. <laughs> I'm not. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm not sure. I have a Finnish man. Okay. Guys, uh, I just need your help uh, asking me. Uh, I mean, uh, I just need your help giving me some <laughs> questions because probably I will run out of questions. Yeah, actually, it is going to be with Gabby the first example. This is just a trial, okay, just for you to have an idea how it goes, okay? So let's get it started. Um, Gabby, do you have babies? Uh, um, not still. Uh, I'm not sure if I can say. Uh, like like a long answer but with a no in that no you're not supposed to answer with no either you know in any place <laughs> okay okay yeah okay, uh, okay so are you single um maybe oh okay are you at university um currently studying oh do yeah. you study i'm currently studying uh, okay what do you study dentistry Oh, so you'll be a dentist? Uh, probably one day. Okay, sounds good. Do you like the career? Uh, not very much. Sometimes it's kind of difficult, but uh, but I'm trying. Is it stressful? A lot, a lot. Oh, wow, very nice. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty good. That was really good. Okay, exactly like that. So as Gary did, thank you so much, Gary. That was really nice. So as Gary did, guys, you're not supposed to answer with a yes. You're not supposed to answer with a no. Uh, but you got to just keep on going and try to give a, like a long answer, short answer. Yeah, but not any of those. Okay, thank you. Let me go and grab somebody else. Um, so, um, Arnoldo, are you with us or are you working? I remember yesterday you said you work at night. Yes, are you working? I am at home. Oh, yes. So we're going to, no, Arnoldo, so you will be my victim all night today. <laughs> okay, so Arnoldo, I got a question. I, I got a couple of questions for you. Same thing, you cannot say yes, you cannot say no. Three seconds to answer and you cannot repeat the same answer. Are you ready? Uh, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good. Okay, so Arnaldo, do you go to the gym? Uh, sometimes. Oh, do you like doing exercise? I like so much. Uh, soccer or basketball? Soccer. Okay, do you play soccer? Uh, like the uh, defensa. Ah, oh, so you are a defender? Yes. Ah! <laughs> okay, <laughs> penalty for Arnoldo, guys. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was really no, nice vale play. No <laughs> okay. Uh, so, I mean, but th th remember that you cannot say yes, you cannot say no, so you have to think really fast. But that was really nice. That was really nice. Except that we have, um, except that we have a penalty for you guys. What penalty can we give Arnoldo? Not dancing, not singing, right? Something, I don't know, something different. Do you have an idea for him? Maybe you can put some uh, tongue twister to him. I like that. I really like that. Okay. Okay, cool. I'm going to write Arnoldo's name here because I am super forgetful. So Arnoldo, um, you owe us a tongue twister, but let me let me think about how we can do it. But nice, that was nice. Arnoldo, choose another victim, please. Who's next? Okay, let me see. Mm -hmm. We have Enrique, we have Kenya, Helden, Andrea. Who? Kenya. Okay, Kenya. Hi, Kenya. Good evening. Hi. Hello, Miss. How are you? Fine. Um, do you listen to us very well? Yes. Oh, okay, nice, nice. All right, miss. So did you listen to the rules of the game? Um, yes. 
I can okay. say yes or no. <laughs> exactly. You cannot say yes or no. You have to answer fast and you cannot repeat answers. Okay, very nice. So let's get it started. Um, I'm going to ask questions quick. So if you don't get me, if you don't get my 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 question, just you know try to think about a way to to answer it. So um, okay. So Kenya, do you um, give me one second? Okay. So Kenya, do you like cooking? <laughs> um, sometimes I cooking. Okay. But do you like it? Mm, I enjoy cooking. Oh, okay. Sounds good. Um, so do you normally, for example, can you make pupusas? Of course. Oh, sounds good. I can make pupusas. Oh, sounds good. But uh, aren't you from Olofista? Like a good Salvadorian. Okay. Sounds really good. So rounded pupusas? Sorry, I don't understand. Rounded, like round, like circles, like rounded pupusas. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I guess we got you. I, <laughs> okay. I lost. <laughs> okay. No, yeah, but that was all right. You started very nicely. Okay, no worries. I'm going to write Kenya, so we have like a homework uh, for you, but but nothing like dancing, guys, or singing. We'll do something different. Okay, guys. Now I need your help asking questions. Okay. So for the next person, guys, I need your help attacking. Okay, this person, so we can get a lot of answers. Uh, Kenya, who's next? Uh, who? Uh, Mercedes. Okay, thank you. So, Mercedes, are you with us? I don't know if Mercedes is here. Mercedes, are you here? Mm. No, probably not. Okay, uh, Maurice, I'm going to take you while Mercedes is back. Okay, guys, I need everybody's help. Okay, I want you to ask questions to Mauricio. Um, so ask him, attack him, all right? And ask him questions like really, really fast, one after the other. Um, you can raise your hand if you feel more comfortable uh, to organize it a little bit, okay? Guys, are you ready with your questions? I'm ready. Okay, nice. That's really good to hear. So, Imelda, well, Elizabeth, are you ready? Enrique, are you ready? Andrea, Belen, you ready, guys? Yes, teacher. Okay, very good. Let's get us started. Mauricio, go ahead. Guys, who goes first? Okay, Belen, let me go with you. I see your microphone on. And then we go with Angelica. Then I see Gabby. Then we're going to have Mauricio, Helen. Right? And then Elizabeth, yes. Mauricio, do you like the English class? Of course. Okay, Angelica, go. Mauricio, you have a pet? Don't like it. Gabby, go. Um, do you like would you like to study another language? Um I Italian and French. Sounds good. Okay, uh, Helen, go. Elizabeth, let's go. Mauricio, are you studying? Actually. Yes, are you studying right now? Actually, I'm doing. Okay, Enrique? Is another Andrea? No worries, Helen. That's okay. Thank you, Miss uh, Andrea. Are you with us? Okay. 
Um, Andrea, your microphone is on, pero no le escuchamos, Miss. We can listen to you. ¿Y ahora? Yes, we can okay. hear you now. Yes. Definitely. Okay. Uh, it's rainy in your house? Uh, a little bit. Did you get wet today? Not yet. Ah. <laughs> no. And I was and I was like, no, it's not gonna. <laughs> okay, so guys, I think we have a couple of volunteers. Thank you so much, Maurice, for the, <laughs> for volunteering. <laughs> So I'm going to think about a penalty that we can have. Okay, but like something academic, something where we can have fun. And thank you so much for participating, guys, and asking some questions. Um, so we are going to check today a couple of things related with subject verb agreement. And then, of course, we are going to uh, check a little bit of uh, things here. Uh, guys, just a little, uh, just a question here. I'm having a deja vu. Por casualidad, vimos esta presentación before? Did we check this presentation before? Not teacher. Not teacher. No. no? You're cheating us. Maybe. No, <laughs> no. I'm having just a, a deja vu, you know, I have the feeling that we checked it with you. Okay. No worries. That sounds really good. Okay, guys, so what I want you to do, what we're going to do is the following. I want you to um, take a look at these pictures, right? Um, and we have exactly one, two, three, four. You have exactly four pictures. We are going to work a little bit with impromptu speech, okay? So I'm going to give you guys uh, four minutes, okay? One minute each time. So you can think and you can make a list of words related to each picture. So how are we going to do that? For example, um, in the first one, you see accident. Can you give me words related to accidents? What can happen in an accident? Any word, no sentences, no paragraph, no, only words. Give me words. What crash, comes to your mind? crash. Okay, crash. Traffic. Traffic, yes. Cars. Ambulance. Cars. Ambulance. Very good. Ambulance. And police. Police. Okay. Blood. People. Blood. People. Okay. Cars. Cars. Yes. Uh, oh, we got it already. What else? Police. Hat. Hat. Police. Police. Como police. Herida. Ah, okay. So, Sorry. like somebody is injured. Okay. Somebody is injured. Sure. So injuries, mm -hmm. the heridas, injuries, okay. Or somebody's heart, okay. Anything um, else? Traffic signals. Traffic signals, okay. So I have here traffic, so I'm gonna include signs. Uh -huh. Anything else? Dangerous. Danger, very good, okay. So nice, nice. Danger sounds good. Dangerous or the mesh. Ah, yes, damage as well. Both are okay, because danger, I mean, it's a still a little bit of danger. And damage, because probably a car was damaged, or the, um, a house, or a person, or maybe not a person, maybe property, right? So let's do exactly the same with the rest of them. So here we have in the picture, we have uh, this plant. Right, so can you come up with a couple of words related to this one, to gardening plants and everything? Or yeah, uh, for example, here we have supermarket. So what comes to your mind when you see a supermarket? Um, don't make a list of products, right? <laughs> but like anything else, what else can you see there? Uh, or if we have like hidden sports, what comes to your mind when you see a sporty person, for example? So I'm going to give you four minutes, guys, uh, on your notebook. Let's make a list of words. And later you share the list with me because we're going to work a little with this vocabulary building. So let's do it, guys, four minutes. Four minutes. Um, hi guys, I think we have more people. I see, hi Francisco, good evening. Uh, Iris, hello, great to see you. 
Good evening, teacher. Judy, good evening. How are you? Hello. 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 Thanks. Nice to hear that. Thank you so much for joining, guys. Um, so I don't know if you heard the well we will do. Uh, so let me just refresh that really quick. Uh, for each picture that you see in the presentation, we are going to make a list of words that are related to the pictures. Like for example, here you have accidents, so we can see a crash, a traffic, car, ambulance, police, blood, uh, people, etc. If you see gardens or gardening, what comes to your mind? Uh, if you see like a person buying things, shopping, so what comes to your mind? And if you see like a sporty person, an athlete, so what comes to your mind as well? So I'll give you like some minutes, make a list, and then we share. Thank you. 